so I got my idea from my friend Sean, who has Staggart's disease, and it affects your eyes, causing you to go blind. So I found this Miro GSM, which works when you make a phone call, you create GSM signal. So when the postman scans the QR code, it brings up the embedded information, which is the phone number and a predefined text message to activate the Miro GSM, which then turns on a strobe light and alarm to tell Sean that he has mail, which then he can go over and switch off and then go down to his post box to receive his mail. Uh, well, we designed a gun for applying marking fluid to sheep, so comparing to using aerosol sprays and buckets of marking fluid, we fill the fluid into the cartridges which screw up into a gun like this. If you want to just see here how the fluid just pumps out like that and then wipes down onto the sheep. Well, we are twin sisters who grew up on a sheep farm and we know the difficulty of marking sheep, so we decided there had to be an easier way to mark the sheep and this is where the idea came from. So my device is for if the farmer gets off the tractor and forgets to apply the handbrake, this device will automatically then apply the handbrake. It's operated through a weight sensor in the seat and when the tractor is put into neutral it applies the handbrake. So the tractor is put into neutral, the weight comes off the seat, it applies the handbrake. So basically we just measured like did people know about radon because we live in a high risk area. And so then we compared it to people who lived in a lower risk area and see if there's any difference in the awareness. Radon is a naturally occurring radioactive gas and as you can see it's like more common in these mountainous areas like in Leinster. Basically it forms because of the uranium in the granite breaks down into radium and that gives you your radon. And it causes 250 cases of lung cancer each year.